Hi everyone, um, today I'm going to show you what I've done with an HTC Desire uh, a USB battery, um, a portable USB uh, hub and a keyboard. Um, I've turned the HTC Desire into a USB host controller. Um, so that is to say I've used the uh, USB hardware inside the phone and modified uh, stop kernel uh, and installed it so uh, I can use uh, USB peripherals on my phone. Uh, so I'll show you the setup. You can see the desire there. Here's the USB battery. I just bought that from Maplins. See, it's got a full charge. Um, this is a modified USB cable. Um, you can see the data wires here, those are the white and green ones. They go from the USB hub to the phone. And then you can see here the red and black power lines, uh, which I've split from the battery. And they go back to the phone and also down to the hub to power the hub by the upstream port there. Uh, this is just a modification I've made for an additional USB battery. Um, this is the hub, it's just a standard four port hub, probably cost me about five quid. Um, I've just taken the casing off uh, in order to modify the power supply. And this is a keyboard. It's just an Apple USB keyboard. Nothing special about it. So, uh, I'll show you the uh, how it works. It's my phone desktop. Let's see if I can zoom in a bit for you. So first of all, I'll bring up a terminal. Switch to root. I can't really focus on it. That says SU. Another super user request. Right now I need to get my virtual keyboard back. So I CD to where I've stored my modules on the SD card. So now I'm in that folder. Did you see that? Really the phone doesn't want to focus on it. And then I go and run a little script. I wrote. And all that does is loads in four modules, which are part of my compile, kernel compile. And those four modules. Uh, USB core, EHCI, HCD, USB HID, and USB KVD, which is the four required modules. Okay, so you can see now my virtual keyboard's disappeared. So I'm going to switch over to my Apple USB keyboard, and you should be able to see some characters appearing right there. Let me get a bit closer. Hopefully you can hear me typing on that. Now if I press the page up key, I get back to my main menu. And you can see me navigating around the screen using the arrow keys on my keypad. Here's Spotify. So, just to make it even clearer, get this keyboard a bit closer. You should now see me moving around the screen. There it is. USB host mode on the HCC design. So I'll be posting instructions on how to do this really soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.